Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. At MKS Applied here we have Charles Brown. And tell us a little bit about what you do here. Well, MKS Supply has been around for about 30 years. And primarily we sell, we, we sold high point firearms and inland manufacturing firearms to uh, through distribution to dealers. Uh, last October we flew to Russia, talked to the Russians and Ed Barnol, and um, they're the, one of the largest uh, ammo makers in Russia. They make the steel case um, affordable, affordably priced ammo. And they've been doing that for 70 years. So we put a deal together with them where we were the importer of record and we're also the marketer for Barnol, the Barnol name here in the U.S. Um, they're very well known in Europe, but they, they're a little less known in the U.S. Um, however, they do uh, do several private labels of uh, steel case ammo that we all have bought and shot over the years. Sure. Um, th their game plan is to bring the Barnol name to the U.S. market. And from what we can see, there there are several cases of ammo here. This is going to make its way out to the U.S. consumer. People will know what Barnoul is and, Absolutely. and it will be priced according to many of the other Russian Correct. ammo that we are kind of spoiled with. Right. Right? You know, low price, uh, large quantities and things like that. Exactly. Well, let's take a look at what okay. what's offered, what ammo is offered. Well, we're down here in the super secret uh, Barnoul Russian ammo bunker here at MKS <laughs> Supply. and. Um, you know, they, they offer the standard uh, the standard characters, you know, 762 by 39, 223 in several different bullet configurations, uh, 308 in several different uh, bullet weights and configurations, um, uh, 762 by 54 R, which is becoming more and more popular in the U.S. market. I oh, love that round. Yep. Um, 30 out 6. Um, also, 545 by 39, which is a very popular round. Sure. Um, they also offer pistol calibers in 9, 40, 45. 380 and 380 uh, Mac. So, you know, very comprehensive uh, 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 supply. Seems across the board to me. Yep, yep. Um, we've got uh, several million rounds here in the ammo bunker. Uh, the Barnoul uh, case is, is attractively uh, marked for retail sale. Also, if you notice, I'm not really strong, it's a 500 round case. So it's a lot easier to carry, it's a lot easier to purchase, a little less money. And it's more uh, it's more retail friendly than your thousand round cases. Yeah. But uh, you know we've 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 been bringing this in since uh, about Christmas, and uh, we've we've enjoyed a nice sell through into the retailers, and you will see more and more advertising and Barnoul ammo out on the market. You know it's interesting because this where I'm standing right now I am surrounded by ammo. This is every gun enthusiast dream come true. I know I eventually I have to leave, but we'll just go ahead and get a shot of what this warehouse looks like. I mean, this, this is this is nice. This is <laughs> You can see over here we've got 308 Barnol. All right, I'm going to pick up some of that for my my AK Vepper. Absolutely. That's one of the each, things. Each skid has between 30 to 48,000 rounds on each skid. It gives wow. you an idea how many rounds we have sitting here. Wow. You know, and that's the thing is, you know, when, when you look at guys like me and so many others, we have so, so many firearms with different uh, calibers that we have to consider. When, when you can save a couple bucks here and there, Absolutely. it adds up over time. Yep. And, and when you look at something like the 308, you know, that can get costly. You know, not so much the 223, but some of the others that you mentioned. Right. Some of the oddball ones. Yep. Hey, a couple hey. bucks. And if you've been to a, any outdoor range lately, you notice on the ground how much steel ammo casings are there. So there's a lot of people shooting steel ammo. Um, you know, there's a lot of misconceptions about, oh, it's going to hurt your gun and that type of thing. You know, the, the steel they use in the casings is nowhere near the steel we have in our in our firearms. I've never so, had a problem. So a, a lesser metal isn't going to attack a greater metal, you know. Right. right. Um, you know, they're, they're, they're all modern, uh, modernly loaded. Um, they're all within um, CIP and, and SAMI specs, you know, so they're not going to hurt your gun. It's it's good quality ammo at a great price. All right. Well, I, I certainly appreciate all right. the showcasing that. Glad to have you down. And I look forward to picking up this stuff in the future and maybe even test it out and see how it goes. We'll make sure you get plenty of testing. All right. I appreciate you watching, and you guys be safe.